Hey, ladies and gentlemen, this is, yeah, you can see my hair is just an awful, awful freaking mess. Oh, my God. Um, hello, good morning, everybody. Um, it is in the U.S. right now where I am at. It is 10.51 in the freaking morning. Why am I still awake? Can any of you tell me that? Um, yeah, I'm, I'm puzzled on why I'm still awake. I feel, like, tired as hell. I just wanted to give you guys an update on what I decided to actually do because nobody has really told me. Besides dragons, there's so many different dragons out there that it's hard to decide. For me, at least, because I love dragons so much. Um, and elemental dragons as well, and prehistoric dragons and everything like that. There's so many out there that it's hard, hard, hard for me to choose. I'd end up making swap. I would end up making glitter mixes for almost every single dragon to send to you guys. Um, so I've decided to make a Pokemon swap. And I wanted to know if you fine ladies would want to make a Pokemon swap. It'd be like a challenge because there's like over 700 Pokemon out there nowadays with the 7th generation out there now. And um, let me just make sure my volume's all the way up. Okay, that should be all the way up. Um, it's not showing me, but okay. Um, I decided to, instead of doing dragons this time, I'll do dragons the next time, but I want to know if you ladies would like to do a Pokemon swap. I know some of you lovely ladies are luckily have, have children, and they would probably want to do it with you. So, it'd be a good opportunity to test your skills and probably go out and find Pokemon cards and see which one of those cards you actually love and adore because I myself at the age of 35 now have crap tons of Pokemon cards not just from generation one I lost basically all my original cards almost all of them I still have a few but I still lost a crap ton of my original Pokemon cards. Including my very first one that I ever got. I know, that's a pity. Um, tear. Um, but I still got a couple originals that are worth quite a bit of money. Um, but to get straight to the point, we are going to be doing a swap um of about pokemon and i would love to see how many people would love to join my group swap uh, my sister is, actually goes out basically daily and comes home with pokemon cards um you can see her channel it's sharon's nail boutique and it's also her instagram i believe name too so check her out and follow her. And her YouTube name is also Sharon's Nail Boutique. So check her out. It used to be Sharon's Nail Art and more. But I'm sure you're subscribed to her anyways. And she is not going to be a host. I'm the host. And in this swap, we're actually going to be doing um, a mix. A chunky in nail art it can't be in this one we need actual nail art like bows or um even if you want you can even send me like because i don't have these and i want to see this is going to be a challenge for you ladies if you can find me um i don't know if you guys will do this for me it's always been my dream to have Something from Gay Pride, whether it be a pin or even a small flag, like a flag that I can put up on my wall. If you can do that, that'd be great. 
But if you don't, if you don't want to, it's up to you. I would love to have a pin for Gay Pride. That's awesome. If you can do that for me in the swap, that'd be awesome. I would love you ladies forever. It'd be like a birthday gift from you ladies. Um, but, um, straight to the point, basically. It'd be a chunky mix, a glitter mix, nail art, and if you want to throw in the, the gay flag pin or bracelet, um, they look like this, like these armbands, like these small armbands, they look like that, those are gay bride bands. I can only wear the thinner ones like those because the thicker ones take up too much room and they're too tight. My wrists are thick. Yeah. My twin actually has a crap ton of them. And every time I see her, she has to give me one. So, um, yeah. She already made the deal with me. She can't go back on it. We pinky promised. So, in my family, when somebody makes a pinky promise, you deal with it. Or if somebody double dog dares you, you go through with it. And basically, um, if you haven't noticed yet, I got my septum pierced. And I did that for my birthday gift for, to myself. And also in my family, my brother, I think it was my brother or some one of my sisters, double dog dared me that I wouldn't get it done. Guess again, I got it done. And um, I mainly got it done for my birthday gift to myself because I always wanted one. So this is the end of the film. And you have to be over 18. I'm the host. And um, the baggies have to be four teaspoons in each baggie. So everybody gets a good amount. Actually, you can put enough in there to the point where you think, basically, it would be a good amount. I I would actually think that, like, three teaspoons or four teaspoons into, like, uh, like a baggie, like how my baggies are, like, full, would be fair. Because everybody deserves to have enough, you know? I think, I think it would be nice if somebody gave, like, a full baggie to somebody. Not to the point where it's going to burst open in the mail, but to the point where it's a nice enough bag. Like, they give it as a gift to people, you know? Because my bags are always going to be a good lump sum to, to people, you know? So, it's up to you guys. Remember, you got to be 18 and older. You have to be... You can come from Maine. You can come from, you know, the U.S. You can come from Vermont. You know, and you got to send an extra bat. You have to send an extra package thing, um, with your address and everything like that on it, and you have to send me uh, shipping money in it too, so that I can send it back to you because I can't afford it, um, to send it back to you. So those are the rules. Okay, ladies, make sure you go buy. You gotta bring money. You have to put money in a Ziploc and put it into your envelope with the swaps and um, everything like that. So if you have any questions, leave a comment down below. Thank you guys, and I'll talk to you soon. Remember, Pokemon. Look them up. Bye, guys.